Hello, welcome to the Spoon Fork Heart Kitchen. สวัสดีค่ะ My name is Siri. Today I gonna show you how to make Thai basil with chicken or for Thai people we call this p a t k a p a o gai. Chicken, chili pepper, garlic, Thai basil, fish sauce, seasoning soy sauce, black soy sauce, soy sauce, oil sauce, sugar, and cooking oil. First, I gonna g r i n chili and garlic in the p a s t and mortar. Okay, for make it easier, we're gonna make our salt here before we go start cooking. So we, if you mix all your salt it ready over here, make it a lot easier. You just pour everything is in one time. Okay, it is all the salt. Back, uh, this is a back soy salt. Gonna be a little bit thicker. All different the soy salt um, make you different taste. So this all important. Look like a lot of salt, but you need all different taste for all this salt. How cute this one! <laughs> so cute, <laughs> sugar. Turn on the stove until your pan hot enough, and then add the cooking oil. I use about two tablespoon for this uh, recipe. And when your oil hot, when your oil hot enough already, just put the Chili and garlic. Go for it. Okay, and mix them. You not want to burn chili and garlic. You just want it very very nice smell. So very very good smell. So just continue to stir until you find your seven. Coughing a little bit. That's that's mean the it's good to go. Okay, and now your chili and garlic give you a a very very good smell already. Just add your meat. This uh recipe, this the uh, this you can change with beef, pork, or your favorite meat. I turn on the stove to be high now. And continue stir to cook all the chicken. And now, at this point, the your meat are more than normal. This is a classic style, but normal. If you like to add some vegetable, I recommend the string bean or onion, some sweet pepper. Or some other your favorite vegetable can add into a dip toy, but this is a classic style, so I just gonna leave like this. And now, next we're gonna add our sauce that we mix everything earlier. This is gonna be good. And just uh, turn the high heat and let the cook together a little bit. Okay, here now we done. The last thing, turn off the stove and put the one handful of basil. Trust me, this is not a lot of basil. You love it. I already turn off the stove like this p o i n but uh, because the basil is uh, easy to cook anyway, just get in the meat and try your food. Maybe you might need some. Soy sauce or something to try your food. Okay, I'm gonna try mine. Now I'm gonna make the fried egg. That's a go good with the, our chicken basil. But the, like I tell you, it is your option. Here now we done super easy lunch and delicious. Now we're gonna make a plate. I do the easy style like street food in Thailand. Just put the your. Basil and chicken on top of the perfect with the jasmine rice. Perfect taste, perfect with the jasmine rice. Okay, now and also your egg, of course. 
But for the egg, it's a your option. But I tell you, it's so good with the egg. Okay, you want to put your egg on the side? Yep. And we're gonna try the food, of course, not forget uh, your condiment salt. Further, I'm gonna put our condiment salt on top. Of course, the condiment salt is like um, chili, garlic, and shallot. And put it, slide the lamb inside there. Okay, and look how the egg, nice and creamy. Oh, I want to try this like now. So, I'm gonna go ahead and try this. Street food in Thailand remind me again. It's so good, easy, nice, delicious. Give you a little spicy and um, how the basil, fresh basil. You gotta give it a try. They're so e delicious and they're so easy to make it. If you like the recipe, please give me a thumb up, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and you will see me for the next recipe. Thank you.